Okay, that's perfect. Should I spell it right? Yeah, Timberland. Okay. Okay guys, before I shoot these shoes, I want to tell you guys how I really feel about uh, some of the things I shoot sometimes. Especially shoes. Um, I know we're right around the holidays, Christmas time, giving and etc. And destroying stuff is not one of those things I really enjoy too much. Especially when it comes to food and shoes. Uh, because in my head I'm thinking I can probably donate these shoes to the local shelters and uh, to people that really need them. And deep down inside it really breaks my heart to see things to be destroyed like shoes and certain kind of food that I can probably donate it. I know a lot of you guys already think that I you know, destroy a lot of stuff and it has become part of this channel unfortunately. Uh, even though it really bothers me sometimes deep down inside and I just don't show it and talk about it too much. And this is one of the things, of course. You know, I've been to 20 different countries. I've seen a lot of suffering and people uh, not having the shoes they need to wear and also not having food to eat. And we've been really blessed in America to have this ability to just walk into the stores and buy a whole bunch of pair of shoes and just destroy them. And that's something I don't want to really encourage and teach for you guys to do these kind of things. I know on the camera it seems like uh, we destroy a lot and some of you guys know I donate a lot of the stuff and uh, we've shown you guys that we give back. It's just personally I'm not the type that puts it on the camera but way before this channel got started we've been helping shelters, local shelters uh, in our neighborhood, uh, kids that don't have the stuff, uh, also people that are kind of homeless sometimes they need a place and uh, I work with a lot of uh, local shelters uh, try to help them out. So I don't want you guys to get the wrong impression here that you know what we're always destroying and some of the things uh, really I, I get sensitive towards. Uh, shoes is one of them for example and uh, sorry my voice is gone. Shoes is one of them and uh, for every shoe that I will destroy today I will take that times three and uh, I will donate it to the local uh, shelter. I don't like putting it on the camera oh hey I'm giving out like shoes and stuff like that like uh, I'm just not into that. Uh, I just hope you guys take my word when I say I'm gonna donate them. Anyway, so that's what we're doing unfortunately today. We're shooting shoes, boots, and I'm gonna shoot it from two different areas to see how many of these boots it takes to stop a 9mm. Okay, I hope that kind of explains my emotional connection with uh, destroying stuff. I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, don't get uh, too upset about it. But that's what it is. All right, let's shoot them. Here we go. Get out of the way. Thank you. In a perfect world where a cat and a dog get along. Hi, Mayo. Hi, kitty. Oh, you want some attention? Can you guys please leave? <laughs> Rico, can you take your friend out of here? <laughs> Hi, Maya. I'm gonna use the Glock 19. <coughs> and we're gonna do the 115 grain full metal jacket. Sorry about my voice. I know I sound like a horse. I've been a little sick. All right, here we go. Okay, so it looks like it went through all of them. Here's the first entry on the first shoe. Came right out and went through all and went out of the last one. So 10 of these boots didn't stop it from the side. So now I'm gonna try to, because this uh, bottom part is a little bit thicker, I'm gonna lay them like this and shoot them from inside, see if this, uh, this thick rubber will stop them or not, okay? So went right in, came right out. You can't really tell. So that's one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. It went inside this one. On the ninth one. It went inside the ninth one. 
came out of the ninth one and that's where it stopped the bullet is over here I see it there it is so nine of these boots uh, stopped it on the thicker side where the rubber is okay <coughs> all right interesting you know what let's shoot it with the hollow point see what happens if we shoot it with the hollow point since we already have them out all right so let's try these hollow point uh, nine millimeters from Hornady see what happens came right out from over there it took a good chunk out so one two <clears throat> three four five six seven oh it's stuck in here that's why I couldn't find it okay so <clears throat> okay so one two three four five six seven it stopped on the seventh one I don't know if you can see that, but it's stuck right in there. It's right there. Okay. Let me get it out. There it is. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed these results. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. That's Rigo's girlfriend. <laughs> Rigo, don't ignore your girlfriend, even if you love her. She's flirting. <laughs>